Read a book every day for small children. Hi kids, let's read the book The Night Before Easter by Natasha Wing illustrated by Kathy Cowrie. It was the night before Easter. Just before dawn, not a creature was stirring out on the lawn. Our baskets were set on the table with care, in hopes that Easter Bunny soon would be there. Sister and I were tucked snug in our beds while vision of jelly beans danced in our heads. Then out in the band, the hens made such a clatter. I sprang from our bed to see what was the matter. When what to my curious eye should appear, but a big fuzzy rabbit with a crook in his ear. He walked on two legs, which I thought was quite funny. No rabbit could do that, except Easter Bunny. He sniffed at a pansy, a tulip, a rose, a rake jumped over a shovel and a hose. Then up to our house in just a few hops, he came bearing chocolates and striped lollipops. As I sat on the stairs not making a sound, that swift dapper bunny sprang in with a bound. His soft fur was spotless from his head to his toe. His vest was all checkered, his tie in a bow. His eyes, how they sparkled. His whiskers, how merry. His tail was like cotton, his nose like a berry. He made not a sound but went straight to his treasure. Filled up our baskets, adding more for good measure. Chocolates and tricks and candy galore spilled from our baskets and onto the floor. And just when I thought that the bunny was done, he picked out some eggs looking over each one. He carefully hid them on couches and chairs, the mantel, the bookshelf and under the stairs. When our rooster crowed, he turned with a start, he wiggled his nose, then went to his car. He sprang from the house with a single bound and bounced down the street without making a sound. I read his note as he hop-hopped away. Happy Easter to all and to all a great day.